Hey everyone, just quickly before we get into today's video, I just wanted to let you know that you can now become a channel member if you'd like to support the channel. There's a bunch of different tiers to choose from. Of course, absolutely no pressure. I'm just super glad you're enjoying these series, so don't worry too much, but a few of you have asked about this, so I just wanted to update you. Anyway, let's get into the latest episode. Hey everyone, welcome back to another The Moria's Place Let's Play of Animal Crossing on GameCube and it is raining again. We've had more rainy days than anything else and it is heavy rain. We've actually got some pretty bright and heavy thunderstorms right now. So we're just going to grab an umbrella before we do anything else just to try and keep our little friend a little bit dry. Um, it is of course getting on late on Saturday night. So hopefully, I don't know what time KK shows up. Uh, he's not here yet. He tends to sit here on this little box. Uh, I think he comes at about 8, so we've got about 25 minutes before he shows up. But he will get here pretty soon and we can go and visit him for the first time since moving to Moriland. So uh, we've got some time to do some chores. And of course, check out our house. We have another remodel. So this is really exciting. Let's check out how much room we've actually got here before we do anything else. Whoa, that is... Well, that's nearly probably twice as big with all this extra space. Um, wow, we need to get some more exotic furniture. I don't think we're going to do anything, uh, change too much at the moment. We'll probably just leave it how it is until we decide which direction we're going to take this. Because I feel like we need some more zen items and, and some more exotic items. So I guess it's fine just like this. There we go again, <laughs> picking things up when I'm supposed to be running past. Um, seems we're in here though, we could probably ditch our... Uh, flooring and a shirt we managed to get. Oh, I always forget how dark it is in the basement. Okay, so let's get rid of this. We'll save the carpet for when Sahara visits next because in the previous episode we discovered that she accepts trade-ins in this one. So although you do buy a carpet from her, you also have to trade in an old one. <laughs> okay, so I'm not sure how many animals are going to be about today because it's raining. Oh, what's this? Yours for the taking. I buried a regal cupboard in one of the five acres. Can you find it? If you can, it's all yours. Oh, no. There we go. I didn't actually mean to try and post one there. So, one of the five acres. So, it's going to be down here somewhere. So, we might as well go and check that out. Oh, there's a weed. Get rid of the weed. Usually, we go straight to the uh, nook and go to see what items are available. But, oh, oh, wow. An outfit. A deep blue tea and a pine chair. Nice. Uh, I'm not digging our outfit anymore. So we're going to grab this and check this out. Oh, nice. I like the gradient. That's cool. We're going to stick with this, I think, for now. I uh, wasn't really a fan of that one. The more I looked at it, the more I didn't really like it. Um, so one of the five acres is going to be along here somewhere. Oh, our poor tree is dying there. Oh, this could be it. This could be it. Uh, once we've grabbed this, we'll go and talk to some villagers, see who's about. Oh, no, it's a fossil. <laughs> That's fine. We need as many fossils as we can get. Uh, we might as well keep our shovel out just until we find this. Pippi, I'm not ignoring you, but I kind of am. Oh, here we go. This has got to be it. There's not going to be two fossils here. Yes, we found it. Uh, check it out. I dug up a regal cupboard in the pouring rain. Okay, we're going to grab our parasol back. I love the way the water flicks off of it. Lee, you're looking pretty uh, daydreamy there. Hey, how's your evening? Are you planning on being out and about for a while? Uh, in case you didn't notice, it's raining tonight. Don't you think you ought to rethink this, cutie? You'll be so totally sorry if you catch a groggy cold. So, what's going on, cutie? Um, do we dare ask for a job? Give me a job, Lee. An errand. You know, I was just thinking of something. Nope, sorry. I guess I can't remember what it was. That's okay. Uh, well, we found the item. Um, so, we could probably carry on searching for... Oh, Tybalt. Well, hey there. Evening, Maury. I didn't see you at all during the daylight hours. Were you really busy all day or something? Yeah, we were patiently waiting for KK Slider to arrive. And he's still not here yet. Um, and thinking about it, I hope he turns up in the rain. <laughs> the rain really throws a huge wrench in everyone's plans, huh? Anywho, you probably want something, don't you? Uh, what is it? 
Let's let me help you. Let me think. Yeah, okay. Go to Buzz's pad and get my hanky. I hope he's washed it. Get my hanky chief back before I freak out. I only need it for a little while. I'll bring it right back. I swear. Yeah, right. So can you do it? Uh, I'll handle it. We'll go straight there. We may as well. We may as well do like a loop of the town. See see who's about. Head to Buzz's and then from there, head up to the Nook and Go. Hello, Willio. Oh. Oh, I thought it was a new villager. It's Bell. I forgot about Bell. Okay, so actually, how many villagers have we got? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Did I count those right? Fifteen. <gasps> Sydney. Whoa, new villager alert. This could be our final villager. I did not. We were walking down that side of the island or town as well. I totally didn't see it. It must be lower in... Oh, no, this is where we're going to plant the orchard. Is this... This has got to be it. Sydney's house. Is Sydney a kangaroo? I'm pretty sure. Oh, no, a koala. Eek. <laughs> I guess it's right. An intruder in your house. What the? Hey, don't startle me like that, sunshine. You almost gave me a heart attack. Maybe it's just me, but don't you think it's rude to startle a lady before you've even met her, Sunshine? Where are your manners? But I'm over it now. Just had to catch my breath. My name is Sydney. Try to be a little calmer from now on. Talk to me in a soft whispers at night, okay, Sunshine? Okay. Loving the cabin furniture. Not sure this clock goes with your setup, but I like it. Maury, hi. How are you this evening, Sunshine? So, tell me, Maury, what did you want, Sunshine? Seems you've just moved in and all. Maybe you've got some work for us. I wonder, could you go to Buzz? <laughs> oh, Buzz again. See if Buzz is finally through with my picture book. Buzz never returns anything. Yeah, we're, get we're getting that vibe. Even if you say you need it back right away, it's a pain, Sunshine. I know it's sort of a hassle, but could you go and find it in your heart to go and get it back for me? Sure. Good luck, Maury. I'm sure you'll do your best, Sunshine. We certainly will. We're going to go and grab two things off of Buzz now. Oh, wow. So that must be our 15th villager. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. So, rumor has it that after you get 15 villagers, probably not today, but on one of the days, Tour Timer makes his way along the river somewhere. And suggests a new location for a bridge, which is really awesome because we desperately need a new bridge. I'm thinking probably at the top of this acre or maybe under the cliff here so we can kind of come down the ramp and then straight underneath. That would be pretty cool, but I'd go for either here or a bit further up, I think. So we also need, we've got a spare shovel. We also need to keep our eyes open for the golden spot. And hopefully it's in a location where we can actually plant it and it will grow. Buzz, don't run away. We're coming to pick a couple of things up in the rain here. Hey, how are you doing, Captain? Is that right? Good, good. But if you work too hard, your body might just shut down completely one day. Wow. Uh, sure, laugh it up, Chuckles. We'll see who's laughing when you get soaked <laughs> and catch a cold. That's very true. We've got a, a parasol. We've been as careful as we can. Hey, why are you even talking to me, Captain? I'm picking up, actually. Oh, whoops. Are you going to take the handkerchief back to Tybalt? Well, then here it is. I truly appreciate it, Captain. Thanks. And now we need a picture book as well. Okay, that's all I have to say. Get a move on. Uh, that's not all I have to say. Oh, so it's you, Captain. Yeah, so what do you want, Captain? I'm... Picking up a picture book. Here's Sydney's picture book. I should never have kept it for so long. I'm bad. I'll send a letter apologizing to Sydney, but can you throw an extra sorry in for me when you return it? Of course. She'll she'll be just glad to get it back, I'm sure. Bah! If you're going to do this, then get going. It's all you, Captain. Thank you. Alright, before we head back to around that side of the island, let's head up to Nook's and see what furniture he's got. We haven't got much money actually. You got 3,000 bells. Ooh! A camper in a different location. We haven't got two, have we? Oh, no. It's just... This is a cool spot right here. This is an excellent spot for a camper. Let's check it out. Who have we got? 
A new villager and a new camp. Oh, boots, the classic. I love boots. Oh, hey, sorry, but I'm not giving out any camping lessons today. I'm a little late and I'm kind of busy. Oh, you're just visiting. Cool, cool. My name's Boots and you're Maury, right? Sorry about that little misunderstanding, but I'm such an accomplished camper that I get a lot of fans. If you say so, this is a, this is cool. I just I just love the campers so much because it's a great way to get some limited time items or exclusive items, and it's good just to see new villagers. Hey, are you here to do some hardcore mountain climbing with me? Sure. You're kidding. No one ever wants to go with me. Um, actually, I don't have enough climbing gear for both of us. Yeah, that's the deal. So why don't we play a game instead, Munchy? Munchy, okay. Don't talk about food, I'm getting a bit hungry. It's getting late in the day. <laughs> Great, I need a little entertainment, Munchy. Now where's, uh, here's what we'll do. I have some pictures of some fish we've, I've caught before, but I also have some pictures of fish caught by professional anglers. I want you to try and figure out which is which. If you get it right, I'll trade you for your pine chair. But if you get it wrong, I get your pine chair for free. So what do you want to show? Uh, do you want me to show you my photos? Yeah, go on then. Take a look at these photos. Aren't these some beautiful fish, Munchie? Here's a salmon. This is a bluegill. This is a stringfish. And this is a beautiful large... Oh, I'm getting flashbacks of the fish. So, smarty pants, which of these fish did I catch? We're going to go straight for the stringfish. You said stringfish, right, Munchie? You think I caught a stringfish? Uh, I'm hoping. <laughs> I wish, but I have... Oh, no. Looks like I get the pine chair from... Well, we, we dug it up for free, to be fair. We could probably buy it from Nooks if we want to. Uh, well, Boots, we'll catch you later. No doubt we'll do some more games later on because I do want to try and get some more camping equipment. But let's go and see what Nooks has on offer today. Oh, is he open? Pardon our mess. We're remodeling <laughs> again. We hope to reopen soon. Wow, that is super quick. I felt like we've hardly spent any money in there. I swear that's quicker than usual. I thought it looked closed. Oh, no. We're not going to be able to pay off our debt, I don't think. Because we have no way of getting money. Oh, there's a bug hiding in the tree. Hiding in the tree. Yes, I caught the famed Dynast Beetle. It's incredibly strong for its size. Oh, wow. Well, in that case, we're going to have to search for the money rock and try and do some chores because the the um, sometimes the villagers do give you money, but it's only like, I don't know, it's only like 100 bells or 200 bells at a time. Um, but that, yeah, it's not so bad. Let's, let's, before we do anything then, let's make our way back to the villagers to finish these chores off. We need to see Tybalt and Sydney. And we can also look for the glow spot and the money rock so it's gonna be around here somewhere most of the villagers seem to be inside their houses which is pretty sensible I think okay I don't know if we've even tried this rock that much no never is the first one is it okay there's a couple of more rocks down here I don't know if Tybot's made his way back home yet it doesn't look like it okay money rock we might have to use the... Oh, we haven't got an axe. Oh, no. Chicken, get away from me. Okay, if you get too close, you can end up talking to the chicken. Oh, it's not that one. Okay, here goes. No. Okay, we're going to bump into Sydney anyway. Just down here. Her house is... Is this her house? I can't remember. Sydney's house. Yeah. Okay, let's return her picture book. Sydney, I've got your picture book. Wow, it's already 7 p.m., huh? So tell me, Maury, what do you want, sunshine? I've got a delivery. Uh, here's your picture book. What's this? Could it really be my picture book, sunshine? I thought I'd never see it again. This makes me really happy, sunshine. So I have a little reward for you. It's some um, stationery. <laughs> wow. Thank you. I do, I do appreciate it, really. I don't mean to see I'm ungrateful. You know, I sure hope I can count on you whenever I need help in the future, Sunshine. Of course. Okay, so. It must be nearly 7. Oh, no, 8 p.m. 
We're waiting. Oh, 10 minutes until KK Slider. Her time was a bit off. <laughs> it's nearly 8 p.m. And we're patiently waiting for KK Slider to turn up. In the meantime, we need to... Oh, who's that? Oh, Tybo. We're looking for you as well. Hey, how are you doing? Grr. <laughs> uh, doing all right, Maury? Anywho, you probably want something, don't you? So, what is it? We're, I've got your delivery. I've got your... I can't remember what it is. Oh, your handkerchief, is it? That's it. That's my handkerchief. I never expected to see it again. I didn't think you'd ever find it. You're the best. This is awesome. Now for your reward. How about some stationery? <laughs> if I give you this, you can write me. Sure. Not that anybody understands my letters anyway. Um, I ch is there any other way of making money other than... We can shake trees, can't we? We can search for the money rock and the glow hole. But there's no other ways other than doing chores and hoping we get presents. There's no other way of getting money, I don't think. Other than going to the island, but we haven't really got time for that. Oh, here's the money rock. Go as quick as we can. We need the 10,000 bells. Oh, we never have got the last bag out. I wonder if you can't in this game. Or maybe you have to use the axe. Because the gap between the hole and the rock is, is quite big. So you bounce back. Okay, looks like... Oh, we got the 1,000 bell bag, it looks like. So... Oh no, my pockets are full. Should I swap it uh, for this or just drop it? Let's swap it. Okay, we might have have enough. Uh, can we pick them all up at once? Oh no. Oh no, I didn't mean to dig. Okay, so we've done the money rock. So it's just a case of finding the glow hole or glow spot, dig spot, whatever you want to call it. And that will be another thousand bells. I don't know if in this game you can dig up any more than that. I'm, if you're having a lucky day and Katrina's giving you good luck, maybe there's a way to dig up more bells. I'm not entirely sure. That would be something to uh, check, I guess. Oh, we should uh, we should probably put our parasol up until we we find it. Um, Able sisters have got their lights on, so they're hard at work in this evening. I don't think... We should, I mean, we could take this opportunity to do some sea fishing because we know some of the rarer fish do come out when it's raining. Although we have been finding them when it's not been raining, but they're more likely to be able to encounter them when it is raining. So, oh, let's check on our uh, coconut tree progress. Hello, Gwen. Oh, weed. Oh, look at it. It's growing. It's going to be another day or two, I think. Ah, the ball. We'll keep that there. It's a good place to remember it in front of the plaza if we need it. Copper, what is the latest? Good evening to you. Let's be extra careful when we're walking alone at night. The darkness is suspicious. Tell me, how could Officer Copper be of assistance? Are there any goings on? Maybe he'll tell us about KK? You ask about goings on. Well, on July 26th, Oh, a get already. Gracie just comes every, like, few days, doesn't she? On July 26th, the police station will be running our BIP campaign, Bust Illegal Parkers. Maury, I hope you have not been involved in any sort of illegal parking activity whatsoever. Ah, oh, you don't even own an automobile, do you? I must beg your pardon. Uh, I wish we did, but what's the date today? 24th, so she'll be back on Monday. Oh, here's the glow spot. Ooh, this is a good candidate for a tree to grow. How much have we got? Check it out. I dug up a thousand bells. Well, that's better than nothing. Let's plant our shovel. In the hopes of growing a golden shovel. I love the way it's instantly a gold little root. That's so cool. Um, so, yeah, that's quite... It's not too far away from the wall. Or it's not too close to the wall. We can dig a, dig a hole there. It's not too close to the bush or the other tree. It's not on the mud. This could be a good candidate for growing. The uh, the thing there. I love that tent location. Okay, so we've done all the all we can do for our money making things. Of course, we're not gonna. I don't know what I'm thinking. We're not gonna pay off our debt today, are we? Because we can't even talk to Tom Nook to see how much it's gonna cost. Um, so we have no way because we've had a remodel. So there's no point in trying to get as many bells. 
Oh, that's that's put a bit of a downer on the on the evening, I guess. But we could still mail some letters. We've got um, one fossil that we can send off to the museum. Uh, not quite sure what's going on in the background <laughs> of this paper. Looks like some. Oh, it's rainy day paper. So some people are not liking the rain, and some people are liking the rain. Okay, we've got one fossil. We need to also write to. We need to write to Sydney. There we go. We'll keep it short because apparently short letters often uh, kind of, they're easier to understand and they'll often send you fruit and things like that. So thank you for the comments on that and the tips for how to send letters that I really appreciate that. So to Sydney, welcome to town from Maury. Yes, perfect. And maybe we'll just get rid of, oh, hot neon paper. Nice. We'll send that as a gift to Sydney so she knows that she can write back to us. Uh, we'll keep our regal cupboard. And we've got a beetle that I don't... Oh, I think we've already got um, a beetle in the museum for that one. Oh, of course. A fossil from yesterday. We may as well utilize that. <laughs> so we need to find one more fossil. Pippi, you're off wandering somewhere, aren't you? Where are you hiding? Oh, where... Oh, we're at the top of this cliff. I was a bit disorientated again. Can't believe after nearly two weeks, I'm still not used to this map. Pippi! Good evening. Hi there, Maury. Your evening going okay? You know, even if it's raining, seeing your face totally mellows me out. I'm not even kidding, little hair. You're like this kind of anti-rain funk mood lifter upper person type person. That's so awesome. So what's going on, little hair? I need a job. We need some furniture or some money. Hmm. Can you take my old chevron shirt to leave for me? My feet are just killing me, or I do it myself. It should be a piece of cake for you, little hare. You do it for me, right? Sure. Okay, then. Great. Cool. Go get him, little hare. Pearl, we don't speak to you much. You're always wandering away from your house, and we never find you. Ah, kitten. A good evening to you. It's been raining all day, hasn't it? How very dreary. I wonder if it happens to be sunny tomorrow. By the by, did you need something, kitten? I want a job. Hmm, what do you need, do I need done? Oh, please stop looking at me with those puppy dog eyes. I suppose I have a small job. Take this glasses case straight over to Pippi, kitten. Oh, <laughs> isn't she right next to us? It seems to have somehow gotten left at my home. I bet you'll get something nice when you deliver it. I trust you'll run this little end for me. Sure. She's right next to us. That's what I need from you in its entirety. It's in your hands now, kitten. This is going to be the quickest one ever. Oh no, she's turned into Snooty. <laughs> Pippi, where did you go? We spoke too soon. Oh no, Pippi, there you are. Oh, all the animals are gathering at the ramp. Humph, it's still raining. I'm sick and tired of all this rain, little hair. Anyway, what's up, little hair? Delivery. I've got your glasses case. Oh, like, wow, that's my glasses case. I was just going to hit Pearl's pad to grab it, little hare. Well, she wouldn't have been there because for some reason she was carrying it around with her. Now, I don't have to worry about going way over there. You're totally my hero. Gracias, little hare. I want to thank you, so I've got some furniture. Just Oh, yes, furniture. Although we need money, we want this furniture as much as possible. Maury, it's nice to know that there are people like you willing to go the extra mile, little hare. Oh, Pippi's happy. What did we get? A wobblina. What's a wobblina? Ooh, it's eight o'clock, which means KK Slider is in town. Well, I hope, I hope he is anyway. Let's mail these letters and then we're going to go straight to KK. And we're just going to double check that we aren't able to pay off any of our debt because at the start of this episode, I was convinced we'd be able to. Phyllis, hmm, a customer, welcome. So what do you want? <laughs> oh, see, we can't pay any money off. So I guess that's because we haven't interacted with Nook yet and we don't actually know technically how much we have to pay back. Uh, I guess we're just going to mail our letters. Okay, we're going to send off our museum letters. There you go, Phyllis. I know you love to work. Yes, yes, in it goes. So is that it or do you have some more? Uh, we have some more. <laughs> oh, we don't, oh, we need one more fossil. So we'll mail these two. Yes, yes, in it goes. So, is that it or do you have some more? 
We just have our one for Gwen, and we'll probably come back if we find another fossil uh, a little later. Yes, yes, in it goes. So, is that it, or do you have some more? Never mind. Enough work for you, Phyllis. Oh, okay. Close the door on the way out, and be quick about it. Okay, bye. Loving our new outfit, by the way. Okay, let's get our parasol out. And let's go and see if KK Slider is by the station. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah, there he is! KK! Hey man, don't stand way out there. Why don't you come up to the front row? Okay. Hey man, don't stand way over there. Why don't you come up to the front? What's going on? I'm in the front row. Cool, baby. I'm always into catching new hipsters on the scene. My name's Tota Keke, but when I'm out here pl playing my tunes on Saturday nights, I go by KK Slider. I'm all about the music, man. I don't need fame or fortune. Commercialism is for squares. It's not my bag. Want me to jam for you? Oh, yeah. Cool. If there's something you want to hear, just tell me the name of the tune and I'll jam. I'm talking about requests. Do you have a request? Uh, no, but next week we will definitely request something. Let me know in the comments what your favourite KK Slider tune is and we will request the most popular one next Saturday. Um, not really. You tapped for tunes? No problem. Dig this one, man. KK Rock. Awesome. Here we go. I'll put a timestamp in the video so you can skip this if you don't want to watch it. But this is exciting. Here we go. All right, KK, what a performance. I love, I, it's just so relaxing to sit back and listen to that. And it was raining during that as well, so it was a really nice atmosphere. And KK Rock as well. That, what a tune. We're gonna go straight away and put that in our house, I think. Hey, thanks for listening. Let me give you this air track, uh, air check for KK Rock. The air check, it's the recording man, the music. It's a pretty cool tune. You can dig it on the box back at your pad. Later. Thanks, KK. That was so cool. Okay, let's... Have we got it on us? Yes, we've got it on us, it looks like. So let's go and put that in our house. Oh, we've got... Oh, of course we haven't checked our mail yet. We got sidetracked with a, a treasure hunt. Okay, we haven't got that much of a cool radio. In fact, we're going to get rid of this, and we're going to go and put the monophone in here, because that suits... Not monophone, should I say? What's it called? I can't remember. Uh... Oh, the phonograph. 
There we go. This that suits the room much better, I feel like. Okay, so there's no music in it. Do you want to listen to something? Yeah, let's pop a tune. Our only tune, KK Rock. Awesome. Doesn't really go with the vibe of the room, but it's better than nothing. Okay, and the item, the radio, the phonograph really kind of suits this, the vibe of this room. So that's cool. I'm happy with that. Okay, so what else have we got? We oh, yes. Need to check out what this is. Oh, cool. Wow. <laughs> awesome. Uh, neat. So what else have we got? We've got, oh, yes, a regal cupboard. Oh, the tape deck. We want to keep the tape deck just because, like, it was one of the first items that we have in here, so. Um, we can get, we can keep the cupboard. Oh, that is a regal cupboard indeed. Okay, I don't like this chair, so we're going to take that to the, oh, yes, we need to make a delivery, don't we? Um, polar fleece. We'll keep that for a little while. What else can we get rid of? I'm not... I'm not really a fan of this bug zapper anymore. So I'm just trying to think of things that we can get rid of with the camper that we can happily let go. Um, what is this wallpaper? Oh, the cabana wall. We need to keep that because we've got a cabana thing up there. Um, I think that's... I, I like everything else. I think that's it for now. But we've got two things. Hopefully the... Oh, it wobbles when you come in the room. Awesome. Okay, so we need to deliver our shirt to... L oh, was it to Pippi or to Lee? I can't remember. Delivery for Lee. So we need to go and find Lee. And then we could probably do a bit of mini games with the camper, hopefully. Lee! Humph, it's still raining. I'm sick and tired of all this rain, cutie. Anyway, what's up, cutie? I've got delivery for you. Here's your shirt. It's here! It really is truly here! I just know I'm going to look so super in this! Awesome! Check me out! It fits so well, it's like it's just made for me, cutie! I don't have much cash on me. Oh, yay! Some bells! So how's 203 bells sound to you? That's okay. Seems about the average, to be honest. Really, just thank you so much. I'll be sure to come to you when I want things done right, cutie. Okay, so we're all chored out. And we, we need to go to the campsite and do some games but first we're gonna do a quick spot of fishing as we run along the the sea the beach and hopes we can catch a bunch of fish okay where is the first fish there it is Oh, I scared it away. Come on, be some rare fish. We don't seem to get many large... Oh, it's a boot. You caught an old shoe. Gross. Put your foot down and say no to littering. Oh, and we got bitten by a mosquito. Man, that really itches. Okay, here's another fish. Oh, they always move at the last minute. Oh, sea bass. Uh, sea bass. Sea bass? Sea bass? <laughs> okay, we don't want sea bass. We want red snappers or barred knife jaws, please. Preferably barred knife jaws. Because they're like 5,000... I'm pretty sure they're 5,000 bells each. Oh, miles away. There we go. We got it. It's going to be a red snapper. I call it a red snapper. That was a snap. I really have to stop saying things like this. Now, I like the jokes. Keep them coming. Okay, so where is... The oh, here, here we go. Straight in there. Oh, no. I think we're going to have to start throwing our sea bass back, I think. 
Release the sea bass. We want just pocket full of uh, rare fish. So when we see Nook tomorrow and go into the new Nook. I don't know what the next one is. The upgrade from Nook and Go. That we can sell them and get lots of bells. Because I get the feeling this next one's going to be a pretty expensive debt. <laughs> oh no, sea bass. Okay. Oh, we're just going to go in and out of this. Acre, and it should spawn a new fish, hopefully. Oh, there we go. Oh, that was super quick. I totally missed it. Come on, fishy. Oh, it nearly went again. Oh, no. This town has so many sea bass in it. Oh no! Oh, the mosquito bit me! And it made me pull my fishing rod in! I didn't realise they could do that. I thought it at least waited until you caught the fish. Gwen, you're a penguin. Come and give me some tips on catching fish. Wow, stubborn fish. Oh, nearly, nearly missed it. Yay, red snapper. That was a snap. Okay, let's get rid of these sea bass. Release. Uh, not that I will, but I'm just checking. Oh, you can't, you can't release the, uh, the boots. I was wondering if you could toss the litter back in the, in the river, but you can't, which is a good thing. I was just curious. Uh, we'll go and put that in the dump in a little while. Best way to get rid of it, put it in the dump. There we go. Come on, redfish. No. <laughs> okay, I wonder if the camper will interact with the fish at all. They might be like, oh, here's some photos of the fish. But by the way, I love the fish that's in your pocket. That would be quite cool. We haven't caught a but. Oh, no. Oh, I thought I missed it. Yes, another red snapper. Haven't caught a barred knife jaw yet, unfortunately. But we'll, we'll settle for the red snappers. Come on. No, wow, where's the red snappers? It's raining really hard. I thought they'd be all around. These red snappers are lucky. Uh, not the red snappers. The sea bass are lucky because we are throwing them back. Oh, we don't want that either. <laughs> okay, I think that will do for fishing now. We could always come back in a little while. But we're going to go and see if the camper wants to play any games. But first, we are going to take out our... Oh, no. Drop. There we go. We don't want the camper to take our bells. How many queens? Have to... Oh, we have to do a thousand each time. Yeah, we'll just do two thousand. Actually, we'll do th we'll do three thousand. We could probably risk losing five thousand, maybe. Okay. Please play some games. We've come with furniture that we're willing to lose. Boots. Yes, I've been waiting for someone to show up. I've heard there's lots of wildlife in this area. Do you know where the best viewing area is, Munchie? What do you mean, just take a look around? Oh. Yes, I've been waiting for someone to show up. I've wanted to climb the summit of Mount Moriland, but I can't find the trailhead. Do you know where it is? You don't? Oh, I guess I'll just have to keep looking. Okay, we're gonna go out. I'm pretty sure it sets the uh, uh, questions every time you go in or out. Boots, let's play a game. Yes, I've been waiting for someone to show up. Camping is fun and all, but it's a lot more fun when you've got someone to hang out with, Munchie. 
So why don't we play a game, Munchie? Sure. Great, I love playing camping games, Munchie. Okay, here are the rules. I have some photos of animals. I took some of these photos myself when I was camping. But some were taken by a professional photographer. If you can guess which animals I took pictures of when I was camping, you get a prize. But if you're wrong, then I get all the money you have on you. Oh, this is what we were prepared for. So, do you want to play? Sure thing, we're going to go straight with the top one. Yes, no, let's see, good photographer. Uh, here we go, here we go. I have four photos. One is a bear, one is a moose, one of a wolf, and one of a seal. Which of the one's photos was taken by me? The bear. You think I took a picture of the bear? Ah, I guess you don't know. Oh, no. I don't even know where to find a bear to take a picture of. You were wrong, so give me all that money. Oh, no. <laughs> 5,000 bells. A deal is a deal, after all. At least we get something in return. What did we get? A modern screen. Okay, do you want your modern screen back? Let's play a game. Hey, are you here to go do some hardcore mountain climb with me? Sure. You're kidding. No one ever wants to go with me. Um, actually, I don't have enough climbing gear for the both of us. Yeah, that's the deal. So why don't we play a game instead, Munchie? Okay. Great, I need a little entertainment, Munchie. Now here's what I'll do. I have some pictures of some fish I caught before, but I also have some pictures of fish caught by professional anglers. I thought they did some games as well, like card games or like guess the number games, but maybe that's by different campers, like in different seasons or something. But if you get it wrong, I get your bug zapper for free. Oh yeah, sure, I don't like the bug zapper anymore. <laughs> so what, uh, do you want me to show you my photos? Yeah. Take a look at these photos. So we went in the string fish last time, so we'll go for the top one again, the salmon. Salmon, blue fish, string fish, and large char. So what, so is Marty Pants, which of these fish did I catch? Large char. You said large char, right, Munchie? You think I caught large char? I wish, Oh, Looks like I'll have that bug zap. These, I swear they changed their minds just to con you out of the bells and the items. Right on. Okay, I want, a sleeping bag. Come on, let's play a game. Hey, are you here to do some hardcore mountain climb with me? Sure. There's all sorts of camping items. Uh, last time we got the backpack, eventually it took ages. Great. Need a little entertainment munchie. Now here's what I'll do. I have some pictures of some fish. Here we go. Obsessed with the fish. Okay, we'll go the third one down this time. Um, it does change every time because last time we did all four before we eventually got it. Um, and all four were wrong, so yeah, we'll go third one down. Take a look at these photos. Aren't some of these beautiful fish munchy? Here's a salmon, this is a bluegill, this is a string fish, and this is a beautiful this beauty is a large char. So smarty pants, which of these fish did I catch, Munchie? Bluegill! You said bluegill, right? Munchie? You oh no, I wish I had, but I ha Are you serious? Looks like a red armchair is now mine. Right on. Oh no, he's taking all of our stuff apart from the the screen that he gave us. Oh, hey, what's up? Are you here to join me for some fishing, Munchie? Of course. Sorry, I didn't know you wanted to go. If I'd known, I would have brought my fishing gear with me. Give me a little advance notice next time, Munchie. Ah, uh, I guess we're all out. I guess what we could do is search for the... Shake, shake some trees, because we can also find some money in tr money and furniture in trees. Um, but I don't know. This could take a while, but maybe we'll find it pretty quickly. Oh, money! Um, would be good if we found the furniture so we could play some more games with the campers. Um, also, I'm not sure how many bells and how many furniture items you get every day. Oh, I think we missed a tree. Okay, so this, this could take a while. Maybe this is not the best idea. Maybe we should go and sacrifice another item from our basement. Gwen, how are you doing this fine evening? Ah, Hon, a good evening to you. It's been really rainy all day, hasn't it? How very dreary. I wonder if it's perhaps be summer, uh, sunny tomorrow. By the by, did you need something, Hon? Uh, give me a job so we can win some furniture. I hate to disappoint you, but I don't really have any favours to ask of you. My apologies. Oh, no. 
It's definitely a, an effect of the rain that animals seem to have less jobs when it's raining. I don't know if that's true, but it seems that way. Come on, where's some free furniture? Maybe Buzz will have some work for us. He's uh tends to be much nicer in the evening if he's by here. Oh, here he is. Huh, is that you, Maury? It's hard to see in all this rain, Captain. Yeah, so, what do you want, Captain? Need a favor? Hey, Maury, you've been writing any letters, Captain? Well, listen to me and listen to me good. You shouldn't just work at all the time. All work and no play makes you something bad. I forget. Anyway, you should make time to write letters to your pals. And here's a brilliant idea. Why don't you start by writing me? Yeah, you heard me right. We're friends, aren't we? So you can write me, right? Right, Maury? <laughs> Sure. Oh no. Yow! I got bit by a mosquito. Man, it really itches. So many mosquitoes. Oh, we need another. We need another. Oh, it's a gyroid. We need another fossil. A mini poltergoid. Oh, sounds spooky. Um, but we, we are also in the middle of trying to get some extra furniture. Um, oh, I wonder if the camper will take a gyroid. Right, we'll shake a few more trees, see if we can get an item. If not, we'll go to the dump, put the trash in the dump, and head to the house and see what else we can sacrifice. Because I'm not stopping until we get another camping item. <laughs> okay, one more tree for luck. Last tree. No. I thought we might convince it to give us a furniture item, but it didn't. Right, we're going to go up to the dump, get rid of the trash that someone littered in the sea. Naughty villager, whoever that was. And then we're going to go to the house and sacrifice an item. Okay, so what items should we get rid of? Nothing from upstairs. We pretty much want everything that's up here. That wobbly thing is starting to creep me out. Uh, oh, we can check out our ghosty gyroid. Whoa, creepy. Okay, so what don't we want? Um, oh, I kind of want all of this stuff. There's the backpack that we got previous. See, we need another camping item. Let's get rid of this wheel. Oh, wait. Did we get that from Gulliver? I think we might have gotten that from Gulliver. So we should probably keep that. Um, let's get rid of something that we can buy again. So let's get... Oh, I don't know if we can buy again. Oh, we'll get rid of the table and the boxing ring. Because we can buy... We can definitely buy those again. Uh, oh, I forgot about... The wallpaper. Modern screen, which is what we've got on here already, but we can we can keep that in our pockets for now, actually. Because we're going to sell those tomorrow when Nook opens his upgraded shop. Uh, let's check out the fossils while we're here. Okay, this is going to be another letter from a villager telling us off. Oh, Tom Nook. Remodeling notice. I've decided it's high time to remodel my store. So it will be closed on July 24th, 2021. It's my sincerest hope that this won't be too inconvenient. Nook and go. Awesome. Uh, we can get rid of these. Oh, what was this one? Yeah, we can get rid of those. Oh, 3,000. That's the same as the other day, isn't it? Might as well keep that for now. And see what our fossils are. And we should have space just to catch a couple of more fish after we've um, tried to win another item from the camper. So let's check out the fossils. We've got an amber, which we've already got. An ammonite, which we've already got, I think. And a, a petra skull, which we haven't got, which is good news. Right, so let's go and see the camper. I'm glad the camper has moved to a different spot. It must be random each time because the last two campers came here. So we know now to keep an eye out everywhere, pretty much. 
Boots! I've managed to find some more furniture. Hey, are you here to go do some hardcore mountain climbing with me? Sure. Actually, I'm here to play a game, but whatever. Yeah, let's play a game. Great, I need a little entertainment, Munchie. Now, here's what I'll do. I have some pictures of fish. Yeah, we know. Okay, we're going to have to go for the fourth one this time. Oh, modern screen. Oh, he is taking the modern screen. That's fine. You can take the wallpaper. We don't We don't need that one. Definitely. Okay, we're going to go for the fourth one. Which of these fish did I catch? The salmon. It's got to be. You think I... Oh, no. How did you... Oh, yes, we did it. How did you know I caught the salmon? Shoot, now I have to trade you something for your modern screen, don't I? Yes, it's furniture. What's it going to be? Hopefully, it's not going to be another um, rucksack. Uh, shoot, now I have to trade you something. I hope you're happy with a ranch wardrobe. A ranch wardrobe? No. Hey, are you here to do... Yes, yes. We want some camping gear, not a ranch wardrobe. Take back the ranch wardrobe. Okay, we're going to go this time. We're going to work backwards and start with the third one. Oh, no, 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 no. We need that. No, thanks. We need... It wanted the skull. Okay, yes. No one ever wants to go with you. I know. I feel for you. I really do. But let's play a game. Great. I need a little entertainment, Munchie. Now, what? here's what we'll do. I have some pictures of some fish I caught before. Are they the same fish? You should change it up a little bit, Boots, to be honest. <laughs> yes, you can take the ammonite. So, also... They take fossils. That's really good to know. Uh, okay, we're going to go for the third one down, which is the blue gill. Isn't it? There we go. You said blue gill. You, oh, no. We already know when he says that line that we haven't. You can take the ammonite. That's fine. We're not stopping until we get a camping item. Um, yeah, sure. Great. I need a little entertainment, Munchie. Boots is very chatty. <laughs> Let's just play the game. Oh, yes. Okay, Amber. Yeah, you can take the Amber. If you get it wrong, I get your Amber for free. So do you want me to show you my photos? Yeah. Take a look at these photos. Aren't these some beautiful fish, Munchie? Here's a salmon. This is a bluegill. This is a string fish. And this beauty is a large char. So, Smarty Pants, which of these fish did I catch? String fish. You said the string fish. Oh, no. Okay, it's going to be the top one again. You're kidding. No one ever wants to go with me. Um, actually, I don't have enough climbing gear for the both of us. Okay, so I'm going to take... No, no, not the Petra skull. Should we risk it? Let's risk it. Here's the salmon. Uh, yep, okay, it's going to be the bottom one again. You said salmon. How did you know? Yes! Now I have to trade you. Uh, what is it going to be a camping thing? Please. We can always get the fossil again later. An iris chair? No. That's not a camping item. Hey, are you here to do some hardcore mountain climbing? I think, Boots, you must know by now we're here to do some trading. Just trade me a cat. Just the sleeper bag will be fine. Or a compass or something. Doesn't matter what item he takes now. Okay, we're going to go randomly. We're going to go for the second one. So, Smarty Pants, which of these fish did I catch? String fish. Oh, no. This is so hard. We're not having much luck at all. Hey, are you here to do some hardcore mountain climb with me? You're kidding. No one ever wants to go with me. Um, actually, I don't have enough climbing gear for the both of us. Yeah, that's the deal. So, why don't we play a game instead, Munchie? Great, I need a little entertainment. Now, here's what I'll do. I have some pictures of fish I caught, but I also have pictures of fish I caught uh, caught by professionals. I want you to try at which, figure out which is which. If you get it right, I'll trade you for the blue corner. Uh, that's fine. Okay. What's it going to be? The blue gill? Oh, it can't be the fourth one again, surely, is it? I thought it would check. We'll try the fourth one again. I think it, it definitely changes every time, though. That's the that's the problem. Okay, the, I can't remember. I think we've got like two items left, so we we can we can still do this. Uh, 
yeah. Oh no, I did this. I meant to press the salmon. Oh! We got it right by accident. Shoot, now I have to trade you something. I hope you're happy with an old clock. No! Boots, come on. One more go. Hey, are you here to do some hardcore mountain climb with me? No, we're here to do some games, Boots. Come on. <laughs> yes, let's play a game. Okay, come on. This is we need we need some camping items, please. We're gonna go straight for the top one. Which I think is the salmon. Oh, it's moved it. You said last char. How did you know? Oh, yes, we got another one right. Yes, okay, come on. Let's have some luck. Exotic chair. Wow, Boots really doesn't want to hand out the, uh, hand out anything. But the exotic chair and the old clock are quite cool items, so I think we'll stick with those. Maybe we'll have some better luck next time. Oh, wow, I can't believe he wouldn't give us any. Okay, we got our bells. And we're going to quickly put these in the pocket. And the exotic chair is perfect because it matches the furniture we've got in our upstairs anyway. So that's that's a bit of a result. Um, there we go. And I think we could probably wrap this video up by trying to catch one more fish and hope it's a barred knife jaw. Which will be really good to sell tomorrow when Nook opens his shop. I haven't seen any large shadows yet either. It's very bizarre. Oh, we may as well let this mosquito bite me. Otherwise, it will scare the fish away. Yo, I got bit by a mosquito. Man, it really itches. Come on. Oh, another boo. You got an old shoe. Gross. Wait, where did our other shoe go? Did we put it? Oh, we put it in the dump already. Okay, this is the fish. I can feel it. Come on, bad knife jaw. No. Okay, I, I really don't know when to stop. One more fish. Here we go. One more fish by the river. Oops. Come on. No. Sea bass. Boo. Okay, we're going to fill our pockets with some shells as well. Uh, oh, we haven't found... We need one more... We need one more fossil, don't we? We haven't found... Our last fossil. We get far too, far too distracted. I think there was one up here. Oh, here it is. Yay, take it out. I don't have a fossil, but my pockets are full. Should I swap it? Swap. I think, can we put it straight in our letters? Perfect. Okay, we'll go and mail this. Put the litter in the dump. And then, I think that probably wraps things up. We've done quite a lot today. I can't even remember what we've done done so much. Uh, but most importantly, of course, we've seen KK, which was a super cool performance. Um, there we go. And then we'll see uh, Happy Phyllis to send our final letter of the day. Hmm, huh? Titch, a customer. Welcome. So, what do you want? I want to mail a letter, please. Yes, yes, in it goes. All right, I'll wake up Pete and get him on this. For crying out loud, who mails stuff at night? Thank you. <laughs> if, the, if it is, then scram. That's it, yep. See you later. Sorry, Pete. Sorry that you had to endure a grumpy phone call from Phyllis. Okay, we may as well 
put our exotic chair in our house to avoid uh Oh, we've got some mail! To avoid us accidentally selling it. There we go, nice! Uh, we'll check out the old clock as well. Oh, wow! It's like a goldy colour. Not nice, it kind of doesn't really go, but it kind of does go a little bit. This thing is creeping me out. I don't know if we want to keep that in there. Okay, let's check our mail. Let's see if we got any from the villagers, which we probably would have. Oh, no. When there isn't a present, you know they didn't understand it. Look, I give up. I tried my best to understand your note, but I just couldn't do it. Couldn't you try to write in plain English next time? It would make things better. Uh, make things easier. Bye now, Gwen. Wow, Gwen, it was not happy. <laughs> okay, let's get our parasol out. I think that probably wraps up this video. We've had quite a productive day. We've done a bunch of chores. We exchanged a bunch of furniture with the, of course, the uh, camper. We've caught a, a few rare fish ready to sell tomorrow when Nook's Cranny opens. But more importantly, we... We checked out our remodel and we made Nook's remodel as well. So we've got a lot to look forward to tomorrow as well. Um, Joan should be here selling turnips tomorrow. And we should be able to check out the Nook's upgrade, whatever that one will be. And of course, we managed to watch KK Slider today, our very first performance, and got our first air check track, which is really awesome. So yeah, as always, an absolute pleasure playing this game and having everyone join in with the journey. So I really appreciate it. I hope you're still enjoying it. Uh, yeah, th thanks for watching, and I'll see you tomorrow. Uh, thanks for watching. Bye!